Sir. Yeah, I think I see you're up to something, aren't you? I am. Your your daughter in law. Yes. This one. Oh. She needs a tetanus shot. She does. And we think it'd be hilarious if you gave it. I don't do shots. When's the last time? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> That is not happening. So you're saying that you you don't know how, or you don't want to, or you don't believe in her being oh. safe and getting a tetanus shot? So here's the deal. I wouldn't do that to my daughter-in-law or my best friend because guess when, when the last time I gave a shot was? 1944. No, I wasn't born yet. Um, it was 1980. Six or seven. That's a lot of a lot of years ago. I say that was that was the year she was born. That's eighty-seven, 30, not eighty-six. That's thirty. That's thirty years ago. Why do you need a tennis shot, by the way? I was helping your son move, and I scratched myself. Let's see. Where's the scratch? That scratch there? Yeah. Hold on, let me get out my microscope. <laughs> it bled though. It, okay. it bled. Okay, so let's play it safe, folks. Tetanus, it, you don't have tetanus because tetanus comes from like horses, horse manure. That's a bunch of horse manure. <laughs> um, but it does, here's the thing. Everybody's scared of tetanus, but there's like a handful of cases a year in the entire country out of 300 million people. It happens. It's extraordinarily rare. It requires a deep wound that you cannot clean. So probably you cleaned that. Plus, a few hours later. I guess we're giving her a tennis shot. We do not need case number two right here in Portland, Oregon. Yep. So would you like me to give my first shot in 30 years? No. Yes. Come on, do it. I want the most gentle person giving me a shot. <laughs> you getting it ready, Alex? Yeah. Is it gonna be a bloodbath? No, not unless I accidentally hit a nerve or something. Mm, so you're thinking there's a good chance you could hit a nerve? Uh, it's a possibility. I appreciate your honesty. It would make for a better video, so. Let me see it. I want to see it. Let me see it. I want to see it. Ooh. Cool. You've been on YouTube before, right? Yeah. All right. Do you guys give out shots before you get a shot? <laughs> oh. You can leave the premises and get one of you back and just not Perfect. Are you gonna come over here? I'm scared. Big uh, band aid or a little band aid? Big band aid. Okay. I'm just gonna clean the whole area here. Does that go me a baby needle? It's a regular size needle. I'm just staying Babies that. get the same size needle as this, as oh, you really? are. Babies get the same size. Oh. Yep, babies get the same size. Wow, that was like expert level. Good lord, that was fast. That was so fast. Really, you did? Yep. I want her to do all my shots. How I'm coming back. Care. Come nice back. job, thank you. My wife has been de-infected and I can now safely continue to be wedded. Wedded. That was amazing. Yeah, that was good. I don't even feel like I had a shot. I know. Well, that's good because it'll start to go sore later. Because of the tightness. Can't find the old guy for an outro, but thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe already for fun medical videos with Dr. Paul and family. And shout out to my wife for being willing to be filmed. And shout out to me for just being awesome. All right, thanks for watching, bye guys. Well, she survived the shot. She survived her tetanus shot, mm. folks, right here, hot off the press, at Integrative Pediatrics. Our staff taking one for the team. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching, I'm Dr. Paul. <laughs>